Yeah, 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 yeah. As one crookshank, your one and only Move Swiftly speaker, checking in for a daily Move Swiftly thought, giving you a perspective on teamwork that you will not get anywhere else. Just kind of want to switch it up a little bit today. And, you know, it, it kind of dawned on me this morning that I haven't done a book review for a while. There was a time where I would do weekly book reviews and I haven't done one in a while. And this week, I actually just finished the, the Seller's Mindset by Dre Baldwin. You know, again, I've spoken about him on previous shows if you have not yet make sure you download the move swiftly podcast he was on my podcast the title of his episode is work on your fucking game which is also the name of his brand and there's so many things so many gems some actually this is the second book of his that I have read. He's written over 31 books. I believe, actually, no, I think the number is actually 31. And this is the second one I've read of his. The first one was Mirror Motivation. And I'm, I still got to, you know, catch up with, I, I listen to his show daily and stuff like that. But anyway, the seller's mindset, as you can, as you can see, and I'll, I'll make sure I, I post a, I'll make sure I post the actual phrase. It's on page 44. He says, you know, if you were, if you were the person that invented the first ever fire extinguisher and you saw someone's house burning down, would you have a problem selling them one now and fast? And you got to understand, just to give you guys some context, he and I, when I was a part of his mastermind, would go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth in terms of what I need to be doing in terms of how I need to get that first ever sale. All right. That first ever sale and all the things, all the gems and all the things that he's, you know, he's helped me work through and helped me think about it. That phrase in itself really, really hit home. And it's primarily because again, he said, he also says in the book and he said it on the show multiple times that everyone's in sales. Every last one of us is in sales in some way, shape, form, or fashion. And it, it really, really strikes a chord with me because from the moment I meet a person or from the moment I tell a person my name, uh, the sales process has begun for me and I don't get to hide from it, right? I don't get to duck it. I don't get to, I don't have the luxury of having a name that's easy for someone to understand. And I, I don't have the luxury of just kind of hiding and, and not dealing with rejection. So the sales process for me starts immediately. And, you know, what the, not only him, but what these kinds of people do for me in terms of accepting that as they, they, instead of me looking at it as a burden, I start to look at it as a blessing, as a blessing. All right. So I highly recommend, all right. I highly recommend that you accept the fact. And again, I, that you accept the fact that you're in sales. First of all, accept the fact that you are in sales. If you're looking, it doesn't matter who you are. If you accept the fact that you're in sales and then you go out and you figure out what you are good at, what process, what things can you do? What things can you do to solve somebody else's problem? Don't start a business, solve a problem, make a sale. All right. Again, I will dive. I Definitely will do a deeper dive on this very topic on my podcast, the Move Swiftly podcast, which I mentioned before. If you have not yet, go to makeyamove.com, M-A-K-E-Y-A-M-O-V-E, makeyamove.com, purchase a few copies of my book, and also make sure you inquire about the hiring seminars that will be going down monthly and the workshops, the moves, actually, you know what, before, the actual Move Swiftly workshops that I will be hosting, that I will be, that I will be offering, that'll be, uh, that'll be offered, that'll be offered as a part of my package and things like that. Again, as one Crookshank, checking out your one and, only, one and only Move Swiftly speaker. You guys continue to move swiftly. We will talk more soon.